Class 10 Social Studies Our heritage of national pride By heritage we mean valuable objects, place and qualities of nature, historical and cultural importance They may include buildings, temples, parks and yet down to the present and coming generation the heritage reflects art, culture, and tradition of the country. Nepal is rich in nature and cultural heritage. Temples, monasteries, and buildings come under religious heritage. Language, art, costumes, and models of life reflect cultural heritage. Natural heritage includes Himalayas, mountains, mines, rivers, waterfalls, lakes, forests, national parks etc so more heritage sites in nepal are given below one lumbini there is hardly anyone who has not heard of lumbini it falls in Upandhi district one can go there by bus or taxi it is crosses in the area of 4.8 km length and 1.6 km wide lumbini is affectionately known as the birthplace of lord buddha a place where only of visit and pilgrimage for people from home and abroad. UNESCO enlisted Lumini in the old heritage site status in 1997. 2. Pasupati Nath Temple It is a famous square Hindu temple. The UNESCO listed Pasupati Nath Temple in the old heritage site status in 1979. It falls in Kathmandu district. The temple is built in Pagoda style. It is dedicated to Lord Pasupatinath, also called a Lord Shiva. There are about 492 temples, big and small, around the temple area. The temple is located on the bank of the Bhagmati River that flows through the Kathmandu Valley. The river used to be clean where the devotees and visitors would happily take a dip and carry the holy water back home. 3. Baudhanath Like Pasupati Nath Temple, Baudhanath lies in Kathmandu. The UNESCO listed Baudhanath in the old heritage site status in 1979 with recognition of its greatness and significance. The foundation of Baudhanath dates back around 592-604 BC. Some Nepali records show it was founded around 464-505 505 BC during the region of Lichvi King Mahadeva. Bodhanath lies in the northeastern side of the Kathmandu Valley. The massive mandala makes it too unique to deserve a place of visit and worship. It is a place of faith, trust, and respect for the Buddhist. Non Buddha, it's also equally love and respect. Bodhanath, the Architectural style is that of Stupa. It is 36 meters high. 4. Saimbunath Saimbunath is the most enigmatic holy shrine. It is the Buddhist temple built atop of a hill. The construction dates back to 5th century or even before that. To everyone's surprise, there are 365 steps leading up to the main Saimbunath. It is believed that believed to be self-created Saitya's images, painted images of deities and temples surround Saimbunath. It is regarded as the religious symbol of tolerance as there is the temple of Hindu goddess Saraswati. Recently, the biggest Statue of Buddha has been constructed down at the foot of the hill. The architectural beauty of the Saimbunath is amazing. The temple gives one a sense of respect and glory. The stupa consists of a dome at the base and a cubical structure with eye of Buddha looking to all four directions. Festoons hang over the four sides with Statues engraved in the pinnacle gazur rest at the top of the temple. 5. Kathmandu Darbar Square 
It lies in Kathmandu district. The Kathmandu Darbar Square received its old heritage site status and is ever since preserved for the future generation to see. Erin, the old royal palace of the former Kathmandu kingdom, you can see several buildings of indigenous style. Saha kings ruled over Nepal from this palace here. Along with the palace, the square surrounds quadrangles revealing courtyards and temples. It is also known as Hanuman Doka Darbar Square. The name is derived from the statue of Hanuman. Kathmandu Darbar Square is the sixth of the Hanuman Doka Palace complex. Kathmandu Darbar Square, also known as Hanuman Doka Square, is one of the major attractions in the Kathmandu Valley. Most of the culture centers are concentrated in or around the Kathmandu Valley. They include cultural sites. The important one is the Hanuman Doka Darbar Square. The name came from the statue of Hanuman established by King Pratap Mala in 1672 AD. Most of the temples and buildings are built in pagoda style with carving idols and statues. The Darbar Square is made up of two sub areas. The outer complex is renewed for numerous increasing temples such as Kumari Gar, Kastamandap, Siva Parvati Temple, Jagannath Temple, etc. 6. Bhaktapur Darbar Square The UNESCO gave Bhaktapur Darbar Square old heritage status of cultural category in 1979. It lies in Bhaktapur district. The structure of the Darbar is of pagoda and Sikhara style. Accompanied by a 55 point palace made of bricks and wood. The structure and look of the palace puts any visitor into thinking how skilled the designers and builders were. 7. Patan Darbar Square Patan Darbar Square falls in Lalitpur district. It is one of the three Darbar squares recognized by the old heritage site in the Kathmandu Valley. Mala kings ruled over Patan area in the past when they commanded the construction of the temples and statues. Patan is predominantly a Nevar area with a marvel of Neva structures. There are many temples and idols in the area. The main temples are aligned opposite to the western face of the palace. The temples and structures in and around Patan Darbar Square are built by the Neva people. 8. Chagunarayan Temple Chagunarayan Temple rests atop a hill called Chagu. It is about 22 km east of Kathmandu. It falls in Bhaktapur district. The ancient Hindu temple is unique for its construction, design and style. Any visitors gets a sense of wonder at the love of art and passion to build such structures by the people of the time. Mostly wood and stone are used materials for construction of the temple. Each of a king Manadev commanded the construction of the temple. That was a time when number style a construction of temples would carry a sense of wealth, happiness and image of the kings. The temple is dedicated to Lord Vishnu and is held in special reverence. It is considered to be the oldest in the temple. The hill slopes down to a plain field through which flows Mahindra River with its origin in Saku down the plains. 9. Chitwan National Park Chitwan National Park is in Chitwan district of Narayani zone in the central Nepal. It was established in 1973 and received old heritage site status in 1984. It covers an area of 932 square kilometer and stretches over four districts Chitwan, Nawalparasi, Parsa, and Makwanpur. In the north and west of the protected area, the Narayani and the Rapti river systems from a natural bound art of human settlement. 
the protected areas represents the tiger conversation unit tcu the chiton porsa balmiki area covers huge plains of alluvial grassland and subtropical moist forest that shelters birds and animals chiton national park is a natural old heritage site rhino tiger elephant deer and stag are some of the animal attraction of the park 10 sagarmatha national park sagarmatha national park derives its name from the famous mountain peak sagarmatha mount everest sagar means sky and matha means head it lies in solukhumbu district The Sagarmatha National Park covers the area of 1148 square kilometer. It has a protected area in the Himalaya of eastern Nepal. This is where Mount Everest lies. The protected area has been identified as an important bird area. The Sagarmatha National Park was established in 1976 and received old heritage site status in 1979.